Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a safe helipad by connecting your SAM tart smartly. This topic has been requested by two of you in the comments. We're going to see three different ways. The first way is using a laser detector and a timer that will open your garage door and stop your SAM tart for you to leave your house. Here is how it works. As soon as you'll pass through the laser detector with your mini copter, a timer will keep the garage door open, disactivate the SAM tart and activate an alarm light and siren. The circuit is divided into two parts. The first part will power the laser sensor, the timer and your SAM torts. We will call it circuit number one. The other part of the circuit, colored in red, will stop the SAM tart and it will open the garage door and the siren. We will call it circuit number two. Start by placing two electrical branches and connect them to the power. Power one of them to your laser detector. Place a timer and power the other electrical branch to the input of your timer. Now branch it to a blocker. Power out the blocker to your sound tart. Now power out your laser detector to your toggle on of your timer. Now circuit number one is done. For circuit two, start by placing anything you would like to be activated when you leave your base. For instance, the door controller or the light siren. Place one electrical branch and power out the timer to the electrical branch. Power out this electrical branch to the block pass-through. This will switch off the SAM tart when you leave your house. Power out your door controller, siren, alarm, or whatever you want. Alright, to finish, set the branch amount properly for each electrical branch. This amount will depend on how many devices you have and how many SAM tarts you have. Just make sure that every component of your circuit has enough power. If the system is not working, the problem is most probably coming from your branch power amount. Don't forget to set the time duration on your timer. Let's see a way now that will allow you to come back safely into your base. The system is based on a detection tower that will activate your previous circuit when you fly by it. First thing, build a tower at a good distance from your house. Then set a battery, an HPHF sensor, a solar panel, and an RF broadcaster. Plug your system following this drawing and set your sensor to exclude others. This way, only you will be detected when you fly by. Finally, set the frequency of your choice on the broadcaster. Now let's make some changes to circuit number 1. Add a new electrical branch at the entry of your circuit and power out to an RF receiver. Place an OR switch and connect to it the output of the RF receiver and the laser detector. Power out your OR switch to the toggle on of your timer. Set the frequency of your RF receiver. Now both the laser detector or the RF receiver will trigger your circuit. 
Don't forget, if the system is not working, the reason is probably coming from the amount of power you're branching out in each electrical branch. If you don't want to bring any attention with your detection tower, just use an external TC instead. This option is way more discreet. The last option that you have is to use an RF transmitter to trigger your circuit. Just set it to your frequency and use it before arriving home. This way you'll be able to disactivate your SAM from anywhere on the map. That's all for this topic guys. Of course you have to adapt the circuit to your base and to your usage. I hope that you found it interesting and if you want me to cover another specific topic let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, now watch out!